Hey y'all, how you doing? Long time no see. Wilhelmina here with Val Decor by Faye. I'm just trying to find y'all here. Hey, we. I'm just trying to find you on. Uh... It's on your Val Decor page. I know. I can't. It doesn't go down any farther than that. Um, how y'all doing? Sorry. <laughs> Nothing's changed. How y'all doing? I um. I'm Wilhelmina with Wall Decor by Faye. Let's try this again. Um, it's been such a long time. I'm really excited to have y'all here in um, my new room. My new design studio. <laughs> um, it's nice and big, y'all. It's so roomy. And it's probably about, I'd say, 80%... Um, Finished. Hi, Mary. How are you? Virginia Prince. Hey, no, I just, okay. Hi, Virginia. <laughs> um, I'm looking at my tablet over there. Sorry. I'm um, to see comments. I should probably turn on my phone too, just in case. Um, Y'all, I'm a hot mess. It's been so long since I've done this. I'm, I'm like really nervous. I'm seriously nervous. So, um, but we're going to do this and um, I'm going to design, I've already attached this like weeks and weeks ago um, to this cute little candlestick and I'm still making some ball because I've got a show coming up October 30th. So I'm going to make it, bring in fall and um, Christmas to that and then I have another show November 20th which I'll be bringing fall, Christmas, and then every day so they can buy gifts too. So I just thought I'd come on, do this quick little candlestick thing and um, show y'all what's been going on in the shop a little bit. Uh, you know, I know you saw some of the live that we did um, on Saturday. Sorry, guy, y'all. I'm really a hot mess. Um, Saturday when we went to Carolina Pottery, so I, I um, put everything in the shop. I didn't get a whole lot for the shop because prices really were up and Carolina Pottery is not a wholesaler. So I just got a few things from there that I could put in the shop for y'all that I wouldn't, you know, it wouldn't be like crazy expensive. So um, that's some of the stuff. I have these leaves. I really kind of wanted to go um, in a rustic monochromatic look this time with this. Hi, Diana. Thanks, y'all. Um, so that that was my thought. I didn't want to put any florals in here, so I just got some leaves of all different colors. And then I got these. I had these um, sitting in one of my bushels. Of leftovers so I you know I might add some of these who knows I might have to run over there I have a bathroom light over there y'all it, it's really cool this is like a master bedroom down here you have like two master bedrooms it I'll have to show you around one time so you can check out the new digs but um, if I have to go right over there I can go right over there I, I have some florals in there Hello, Pat. Hi, Paula. Um, Steve, we haven't figured out where he can sit in here. To, oh, I need to get a haircut, y'all. Um, to sit in here to do the lives with me. So he's in the dining room. So he, you won't be hearing him tonight. <laughs> so that'll be the next live. But I wanted, you know, it's been so long, and I figured we, I need to, I need to get back into the groove. Because you know when you stop doing it for so long that it kind of gets, I know I do, I get nervous like I've never done it before. So I'm going to start cutting some of these up. What are y'all up to? Are you doing, I know most of you are into Christmas now. I have some, um, I haven't even, I my closet right over there is filled with Christmas and some fall. Um, so that I don't have to go run up and down the stairs. Hi, Kathy. It's good to be back. Um, I'm just really super nervous if you can't tell. <laughs> um, 
But all these, all these leaves are from Hobby Lobby. And I really kind of just wanted to go with a nice neutral. I love the wood base. So I just thought I'd just go neutral. And then I have some of this um, Spanish moss in case I need to fill in. Because I made this um, brick kind of thick. I don't know. I put, I attached this when I was still living in the other house. So that's how long it's been sitting here. But see, Steve put up these cabinets. I don't know if you can tell. Oh, I don't think so. But um, I filled those up and I had this in there. It was taking up valuable um, real estate. So I had to take it out. And I'm like, well, we'll just do that tonight. And I have these long ends too, just in case I want to add some height to this. So let's get going. And then um, along the way, I can show you um, some signs and stuff that we've made. We made a bunch of new signs yesterday, and I listed them last night and today. So there'll be some new stuff for y'all to look at. And of course, they're Christmas. I threw one every day in there just for, because um, you just don't know. People are still wanting everyday stuff. Y'all, it's been so long since I've done anything. I'm really nervous. I'm really nervous. There we go. So, so what's new? What have I missed? I haven't been on Facebook as much lately. And I know there was that crash last week. If I guess they call it a crash. Um, Facebook's been really weird lately. And see, when I look at the tablet, I see the um, comment. I mean, not the comments, but the... God, I'm having such a brain fart. The um, caption's really big. So it kind of gives me the lowest. I don't even know if I needed that pic, but... I'm not a pro. <laughs> not even close. Uh, you're so kind. <laughs> I think I should have gone a little bit lower, but we're going to start with this. And I like these berries, too. I love, love, love. This, these are like my favorite leaves. My favorite leaves. Yeah, it's really quiet in here without Steve to chat with. But I guess most of y'all do it. And I'm like, oh, my gosh, they make it seem so easy. And then I come on here and I just have nothing to uh, talk about. I went to the post office today, so I'm getting used to a new post office, and um, it's not far away, thank God. It's like maybe a five minute drive, and um, because we have those, the community mailbox now. Hi, Melinda, yeah, all's, all is very good, yeah. I cannot complain. Um, I'm very, very blessed. And um, we have those community mailboxes, so I prefer to just bring my, just go to the post office to bring all my, you know, mail. And right in that same little complex is the gym and a Dollar Tree and my UPS store. So it's very convenient. Of course, you know, we have to look for the first, you know, the most important things around, like your UPS store and all that. So they were very nice in the UPS store. I said, well, you're probably seeing um, uh, quite a bit of me from God, my lips to God's ears, right? I love these. These are really nice and rustic. I love candlesticks. I really haven't done, have I even done any? I don't know. But I... <laughs> You know, it's another another episode of Winging It with Willie. Because um, I don't think I've really even done a candlestick now that I think about it. I did a really simple one last Christmas with just stuck some gnomes on top and called it a day. A gnomes and a bow. Nothing like snakes on a plane. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm still courting. Yeah, so I don't even think I've really done a candlestick. Do y'all like doing stuff on a candlestick? Yeah, so Steve's answering you from the other room. <laughs> and um, yeah, I, I'm still doing, um, well, I'm still, I still have a YouTube channel. 
that I need to really uh, get moving. And um, so if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do so. Um, and I've been trying TikTok out. This time it's, you know, other than just moving, it's given me a, uh, a chance to do, try some new different things, you know, to branch out. Oh, you have Melinda? <laughs> I'm really nervous. I don't know why I'm so nervous. But I was, I've been watching a couple of videos on people doing it. I'm like, wow, they make it look so easy. I'm like, I can do that. I can do that. And now I'm trying, now I'm sitting here and I'm going, everything has gone out of my head. <laughs> my, my comments keep going away on this. Hey, Michelle, thanks for coming in and saying hi. I appreciate it. You must be, did you get home, um, from the retreat or were you stuck out in, in uh, Georgia as well? I saw Jojo and, um, Megan, we're still in Georgia. I can't believe, I guess Southwest had a walkout and people left people stranded. Oh, not so close. <laughs> Isn't this shirt cute? One spooky mama. Thought that was really cute. <laughs> but yeah, I'm trying to get, you know, get back to feeling normal in a new um, surrounding. It's a lovely, lovely home. And I've already met um, a lovely person named Gail. She, uh, I showed, I introduced her, um, on Saturday on the live at Carolina Pottery. Cause she went with us, her and her dog Bailey. So I'm making new friends and hmm. Oh <laughs> yeah, Steve's dog. Steve has um, taken the dog. Not really taken it, but he yeah. Bailey loves the heck out of Steve. Yeah. Steve's dad. Oh, good. Oh, yeah, that's true. I was wondering if JoJo, I'm like, JoJo, spending all that money on getting an airline, she might have been better off um, driving home with all, all the stuff that she bought at the at-home store and everything. She might have been better off just driving home, her Nana. <laughs> I know that would have been a long drive, but then she doesn't have to um, worry about shipping all her stuff, too. Because I know they, they were... Uh, I don't know if they left anything at the in the at home store. <laughs> so I'm gonna put some of these in because I think these are really pretty, don't you? I think this will go really good. This the leaf up top is a little darker than this, but it um, kind of goes with these, I think. Just want to make sure nothing falls off. Because that one is missing a leaf up there. So I'll probably leave. I'm glad this is a pusher. So that's really good too. Oh, I'm sorry if I just seem like I don't know what I'm doing. It's just, it's been a while since I've designed and since I've, uh, especially on a live. So I'm just kind of trying to get back into the swing of things. It's amazing how much moving and uh, all that stuff can discombobulate you. Hi, Lynn. Are you home? I told you I'd, I'd do it no matter what time. we. I was going to try to come on earlier, but you know me and technology, so I needed Steve's help with the Mevo and, you know, all the lights and everything. That is my... My next goal is oh poop is to uh, I can clamp it good enough is to learn that Mevo so I don't have to worry about waiting on Steve because he had a meeting today and it it went really late so so I wanted to go earlier but that's okay because I'm really <laughs> I'm getting old I'm not a night person anymore. <laughs> And usually we go for a walk with uh, my friend Gail and her dog. 
daily, so in the evenings. But that's okay. I like I like spending some time with y'all. It's been a hot minute. So I just really I don't want to put a bow in here or anything. I just wanted I just felt like all this called for was a bunch of leaves. So that's what I'm doing. Just a bunch of leaves. Leaves and berries. <clears throat> Leaves and berries and acorns. Oh, my. See, I don't know what this stuff is, but it's a little twiggy, so that'll be okay. Just going to try to blend it in. And hope it doesn't turn out like a hot mess so I can bring it to the show. I find myself doing a lot more um, arrangements and stuff. But I have, I have a custom order for a, a, a patriotic wreath right now. So I have to pull out some, I had to order some, some flags online and uh, pull out my patriotic mesh and I'm like, okay, that's cool. You just never know, right? So this is what, I think it'll look pretty cool. I wish these had a little bit more wire to them. Thank you. I yeah, I appreciate if y'all would share. I'm I'm stuck at like 35 or just under 3600 people and I'm I need to get I need to get my numbers up. So I need to be coming live and doing a lot more. I think I want to cut these a little bit shorter so they don't stick out so far. Doing a lot more uh Lives and um, have y'all been doing the reels on uh, Facebook now too on your business page? They have a reels button on there now. Just coming up with all sorts of different stuff. Just when I get used to one thing, they they change it and mess my whole creative mind up because it's definitely not a. a an IT mind, that's for darn sure. But I keep trucking. Just keep trucking. See, I don't know if I'm going to use this one because it'll, it can slide off really easily. So I'm going to leave that one to the side and just pull up another bunch. So yes, if y'all could, I, I, I was in a in my business group earlier and they were telling what you cannot can and cannot say on Facebook so that's got me a little more nervous too it's been so long and I'm like oh god what can I say what can't I say So are y'all liking these colors? Just the kind of, the monochromatic seems to be in this season with the fall. I know y'all are probably way done with fall. But you know, as long as you sell locally, um, you got to do what the people want, right? So I'm still doing fall and Halloween, believe it or not. If I need to, I'll be, I'll still do Halloween. So I, I, I put it in some totes, but I haven't quite put it, you know, far enough away to not be able to get to it. And I'm decorating my house. Usually my house would be done by now, but I noticed my, I think the move-in tired me out a lot. Yeah, that looks kind of cool from the top, doesn't it? <laughs> So I just want to fill this in, make it nice and bushy, bushy. So, trying to make it a little variety and fill it on in. Yeah. I know. They, that's really, and Stephen was telling me that, uh, too many rules. And uh, he was telling me that there's like, I don't know, stuff going on with Facebook too. So who knows 
I keep hearing, don't put all your eggs in one basket, so I'm trying. Because you can go live on TikTok now and, um, you know, Instagram and all that stuff, so yeah. I'm just trying to kind of put these leaves, wrap them around each other so that they look a little more you know, natural and blended. Blended, I guess is the word. Leaves pretty much always look natural, don't they? <laughs> so that's kind of cool. Yeah, this is kind of turning out so far like I, I hoped it would. Oh, look at that whole big naked spot I forgot about. <laughs> Yeah, it's a foam base, just one of those uh, Dollar Tree square foams, and I cut it in half, so it's not as thick as normal. Yeah. And I probably cut it down a little bit, too, so it would fit the, the base, see? But yeah, that's all it is. I've been doing a lot of painting lately, and just some different different things other than just wreath making. But now I'm anxious to make some more wreaths. I made a Halloween wreath for a customer, a, a custom order, and now I gotta make her a, a Thanksgiving wreath with the turkey on it. And then we, we picked out the turkey and we picked out the pumpkin that she wants because she's she got a new, um, camp you know a fifth wheeler and they're gonna go they're gonna be camping for thanksgiving this year her husband so she wants to have a big old um thanksgiving wreath on her camper so that'll be cool that would be fun hopefully they'll have good weather be get a little nip in the air i do too I think so too. I really like the muted colors, especially with this cream. This pumpkin I got, the pumpkin and the, the candlestick I got it um, at Walmart. I, and I only found one of these. I was looking and looking and looking for another one so I could make a pair. And um, I couldn't find another one of the candlestick or the pumpkin. So I was kind of bummed. <laughs> so I'm like, well, okay, I'll just make the one. People are buying one, so that's fine. But I'm in love with this bush from um, Hobby Lobby. I buy it every year. It's so pretty. I just think the leaves. I'm a leaf, a leaf fanatic, and uh, I'm really picky about my leaves. So I really, really like these. I really, really do. So yeah, um, Carolina Pottery had a lot, a lot, a lot of cool Christmas stuff and Halloween. Have you noticed that in the stores that it seemed like Halloween and Christmas just boom, all of a sudden hit the stores at once? From the Goodwill. I never, see I look and look and look and I never really find anything Good at the Goodwill. Or if I do, it's like expensive. It's more expensive than the Goodwill used to be. Ooh, not going. My dent that sucker. Maybe it's too long. I'm gonna pull that one back out. Hey, look what I did. <laughs> Oops. I'm just gonna cut this off and try that again. So let me try that again. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we, there's a lot of Goodwills around too. But, uh, oh, I am, you know what, y'all? I am like five minutes away from the at-home store now. Michael's, Joanne's. Oh, my gosh. It seems like every time I move, I get a little closer to all the shops. <gasps> Dangerous. 
dangerous. I know, I know. I so that's how I feel too. They're really <laughs> like y'all are getting this stuff for free. It's supposed to be helping people out. I don't know. Have you noticed gas prices are going up? I don't know about y'all, but we're paying like three nine three nineteen, I think it is a gallon now. It just it keeps jumping like ten cents a day lately. Okay. Right? Yeah. Oh I know my girlfriend Gail, she was telling me the other day, um, a while back her her she had she likes to buy designer bags, y'all. So she had some designer bags in a tote. I guess you know where I'm going with this, right? Um, her husband thought the tote was goodwill material. Yeah. Thousands of dollars worth of designer bags. You know someone that was working at the goodwill was going, <laughs> score! Oh my gosh, she was so mad. So you know she got a whole bunch of new bags after that. Yep, you owe me for this one. I like this one. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure he was paying for that for quite a hot minute. Is it looking too full, y'all? Because it's a short. It's a short, uh, I mean, too full as in like too wide. I don't know. That's That's my issue with these things. There's a big old bald spot right here. I guess I need to go up a little bit. I think. See, I'm like, oh, I can do that. I can do that. And then I try and I'm like, oh, I don't know. I'm going to cut this a little shorter. I think I'm going too long. Yeah, I've had to start um, doing physical therapy again for my knee. Um, so, and, and now we have stairs in the house too. But I think the stairs are really actually good for me, helping me out. Believe it or not, I, I think so. Um, so I constantly, you know, use it. I don't know. But I, I know I definitely try, try to watch what I <laughs> what I need to go up in the, and down the stairs for. You know, like, <laughs> I don't know about y'all, but at my age, I'm like, if I drop a quarter or something, I'm like, dude, I really need that quarter. <laughs> I know. I know, Diana. I would, too. Sorry, dude. You're dead mean. Designer bags, are you kidding me? Yeah, and like, because like it, her first, um, oh, what bag was it? It was like Gucci or something. You know, one of those big designers. It was her first, her first one was in there. She was like heartbroken. I'm like, oh my gosh, she's still alive to talk about it. I'm going to use my... My needle, needle nose to start pushing these in a little bit better. Hopefully won't uh, bend them like I have been. I just love these light color leaves. I think they are so pretty. I've had this idea in my head for weeks now. And I've been so nervous to do it. So I'm like, okay, you know what that means. You got to do it on the live. Because that's what I do. When I get too nervous, I'm like, I'll do it on a live, because otherwise it won't get done. So here I am. And it feels, you know, I'm still nervous, but it feels good to be back. I really wish you would. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I don't know why they would let people do that. Well, I guess a sale is a sale, they're thinking, huh? I don't know. I don't know. 
I need some more of this color right here in this corner, so that's going in. I think I want, should I put, do you think I should put any of this in there? Y'all? Or does it just kind of bring too much orange, huh? It is a lot of orange. Tell me, do you think I should put, give me thumbs up if you think I should not put some of this in or uh, hearts if you think I should, if I should add any of this, like in, stick it out. I don't know. I don't know. Because it just does kind of bring the orangish in. Well, orangish, it does bring the orange in. I think what I was trying to avoid. I, oh, poo poo. I just, <laughs> oh my goodness, wait till you see what I did. <laughs> Look at this hot mess. Holy cow, what did I do? <laughs> no, I didn't stab myself. <laughs> Oh, I bent it and tore it up. Tore it right out of the plastic. That puppy is. <laughs> I don't know if this one's salvageable. Have mercy. Have mercy. Oh, sad face. Totally sad face. I don't know. I'm going to see what I can do. Let's play doctor here. Some white berries, yeah. I have this, um, I don't know if you call it cat's tails or what, too. You know what? I have some hops also. And, you know, the ones from Hobby Lobby and the, um, that have the brown and the gold in it. Okay, let's see if I can do this without messing this whole thing up. Okay, let's see. Because now it just looks like he's wearing a collar. <laughs> let me see, let me see. I'm gonna I'm gonna go try. Y'all, this is the hard part. I gotta try to get it. That's where my knees are killing me. I'll be right back. Hold on. So have y'all been into Dollar Tree lately? They seriously have been stepping up their game. Now this isn't from Dollar Tree, but look, I have some of this. I was thinking maybe I put some of this in there. That'll look good, don't you think? <gasps> look. That'll look good. I think I'm gonna put some of that. I don't I don't know if I have any white berries. Honestly, y'all, I haven't opened up so much stuff still. So a lot of my stuff, I don't, I don't even know where it's at until I start needing it, you know? Oh gosh. It's, moving is the worst. I got overwhelmed there for a while and every time I think I'd made a dent in my, in, in this room, Steve would bring more boxes in. And I would just, my heart, I could literally feel my heart just going, oh my God, oh my God. And uh, it was horrible. I really did have a few anxiety attacks. I'm, I'll not, I'm not lying to you. It was, uh, mm, it was, yeah, it was a lot of stuff, y'all. A lot, a lot of stuff. I think I'm going to take this leaf off. If I want to add it, I can. But I don't want it on there right now that I can tell. So. Yeah, it's definitely been a roller coaster ride. Um, I must say it took, probably took us about 10 days to get from, you know, but from starting, you know, signing the paperwork 
and then starting to move everything. Because, of course, we had been doing packing for weeks before then. So the house was like a big maze filled with boxes, trying to walk around. Oh. Too much stuff. And then what do I do? I go to Carolina Pottery and buy more. Steve's probably sitting in the other room going, yeah, I know. <laughs> but I was really good. I put it away really quick right after we got home. Not the same day, but, <laughs> you know, <laughs> within the next couple days, he came down the stairs and he's, I'm like, well, I put all this stuff away from, what do you think? Does that look silly? I got to I know I got to add down here. So look at, how about the hops, y'all? What do you think about the hops? Give me some hearts if you think I should put the hops in. Maybe down here. I don't know. I don't know. We'll just, okay. I'll just add it and then not glue it and see if I like it. We will see, we will see. This one's a little hard to cut. It's not a pusher. So that's kind of a drag. My comments keep going away. But yeah, there was a few days there, y'all. I was like, ho, ho. Beat. We slept good. But it does feel... Oh, I wasn't going to glue it. Just to see. <laughs> Caught myself. <laughs> okay. Maybe I should put these lower, probably. And the hops higher, because they're short. See, it's a lot harder than it looks. Well, it is in my little head, y'all. So how do you like the pink hair? It's almost, it's, a lot of it's gone now. And I think it's, it's about time for me to get my hair done again soon. I'm waiting for the text, because of course I've forgotten if it's, and when the date is, so. Time for a cut and color again. Pink is hard to maintain. <gasps> oh, I did it, y'all. Did I put glue on it? Not much, but I did put glue on it. Okay, I'm going to put some in the middle over here. So, y'all, oh, that looks cute. That little bitty. Boop. So, I think I'm going to cut these and put them lower this time go round. I'm going to cut this in two. Apparently I can't cut and talk at the same time. Sorry. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to put this one a little bit lower. I have to remember what I didn't glue. I'm just going to know I didn't glue the... Uh, cat's tails, whatever you want to call these. And I'm going to kind of spread that out. Okay. Oh, that looks cute. So then they're, that's looking cute. See, I have to, I have to be a little more patient. I want my design to look amazing from the get-go, you know what I mean? <laughs> I have to know that it comes in layers and in steps. I love, love, I bought a ton of these pops. I just love the colors. Love them, love them, love them. Did I mention I love them? I'm going to put something right here. Oh, I just think they're so cute. They almost look like little uh, acorns. So would y'all like to see some of the signs and stuff that I um, bought at Carolina Pottery? I'll show you a couple of our new signs. I've been really, I've been finding some really pretty ones to make, y'all. So I've really been loving the designs lately. Like, more than usual. This is another addiction. So we found the perfect spot for them. We have a landing upstairs right by the bedrooms. 
that um, we can, you know, we put our whole little sign creating land up there. So this one, look at this one, is Silent Night. Ooh, I packed back on a diet. <laughs> oh my goodness, I don't want to get my phone. So this one, yeah, you know, this is the eight inch round and it's also available in the 12 inch. <laughs> but I thought a Silent Night one was pretty. Look at with that blue. Blue for Christmas. Blue and silver. Good combo. You can't lose. Um, yeah. Steve just asked if I had all the round, the round ones. I um put all these in the shop so they're all listed. But look at this one. I just fell in love with this. Isn't that? Yeah. And so this is in a 7x9 and 8x10. Isn't that cute? Yeah, I thought I thought so too. <laughs> I'm just assuming y'all are saying yes. <laughs> and then you know, you gotta love a good snowman. So here's a let it snow. I thought this is cute too. Yeah, I'm just like, ooh, I can make a wreath with this one and make a wreath with this one. <laughs> I'm like, not every wreath has to have a sign. And then my little voice is like, yeah, it does. <laughs> Lynn, how are you doing? Thanks so much for coming in. This is a really cute one. It's kind of rustic, kind of traditional. The good old candy cane sign. Merry Christmas. Love it, love it. Love making Christmas signs, y'all. I'm going to start looking for... Valentine's sign soon. Can you believe it? <laughs> I haven't even made a Christmas wreath yet. So I'm really dying to. So I'll have to do one on the live with y'all. And feel a little more comfortable. My heart's back down to normal beating again. So it's pretty good. <laughs> Look at this. I just love this. <laughs> Did I mention I love all these signs? <laughs> Isn't that cute? And then we have, yeah, they're all listed. Uh-huh. Yep, they're all listed. And if you're a repeat customer, um, just type in return 10 and you get a 10% discount. I, um, Etsy said it was going to send out emails to my return customers. But so far, I think it's only sent out nine, and I know I have more than nine return customers. So just um, just know that if you are a return customer, type in return 10, and you'll get 10% off your purchase. And look, here's Peace on Earth. It's almost like the um, Silent Night, but the light blue. I just thought it's so pretty. Hi, Lourdes. How are you? I thank y'all so much for spending the evening with me. I'm finally relaxing a little bit and uh, yeah, it feels good to be back doing a live again. Now I have this Merry Christmas too that I just, like the one I just showed you. That one had, the first one I showed you had the Buffalo plaid um, behind the poinsettias. Now this one doesn't. So if you're, if you're kind of over Buffalo plaid or have never been into it or, you know, want something without Buffalo plaid. But they are listed separately because it wouldn't let me list another um, variation. I know when, right? I'm just like over the moon with all these signs. And then we um, we made like an everyday one. I guess you could, you know, I, I was hearing today that you could use magnolias at Christmas time too. So you could Christmas this up or use it for every any day. Every day? Every day. Yeah. So we have that one too. Home sweet home. Always a goodie, right? Yeah. <laughs> Look, I'm squinching. Oh my gosh. That's one thing I don't miss is looking at myself on camera. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you. So what's, um, when I saw, you know, when I saw these pics at, um, 
Carolina Pottery, I thought of the Silent Night and the Peace on Earth sign. Sign means. And so I got these and I did get enough to put in my shop so there's plenty. And as always, if um, shipping is less than what y'all get charged, I give you a refund on shipping. So look at those. Aren't those pretty? How good would those go with the signs? I'm telling you. Look, this one wants to weeble wobble on the pick. I don't know why, but it wants to get them off. But it, wouldn't those go perfectly with the signs? I don't know if you can see really good, but is that any better than the light? There you go. Look at how pretty it goes perfectly with either one of those signs. So, yeah, these are all in there. So I tried to think of, you know, putting combos together for y'all. Um, this would go good with the Merry Christmas ones with the buffalo plaid. This pig I had not seen before. And it's velvet. And it looks like buffalo plaid. Now, I had not seen this one before. So, of course, I had to get him. Aren't those cute? And they're velvet, y'all. Really pretty. So that would go great with the, um, can you picture it with like even the magnolia sign? Look with the magnolia sign. Or even with the Merry Christmas. Look. How good would that go? <laughs> oh, you can't see. There we go. Steve usually tells me if. There's glare. <laughs> but since he's not in the room, he can't. So I have some of those, and they are also listed in the shop, too, y'all. And then I got some of these. I thought these were really cute. You could put these in, like, your Grinch wreaths or just a traditional Christmas. Look at those. Aren't those precious? And they're nice and thick and sturdy. And they are velvet as well. I should say your Christmas green monster or whatever they make you call it now, you know. <laughs> or if you sell, you know, locally or whatever, you can call it Grinch all you want. But I thought those would look good. Very pretty, very pretty. And then last but not least... The last pick I got were some poinsettias, y'all. And it, and this one is the brown with um, leopard print or cheetah print, whatever you want to call it. But, and then, you know, you can, there we go. I should have had this fixed up before I came live. And I was walking around like a chicken with my head cut off. But look, isn't that pretty? So pretty. It's so good to see you too, Kathy. <laughs> Isn't that pretty? So we got some of those in the shop too, y'all. I just, and yeah, so apparently everything, you know, velvet is like in this season for big time. For big time. <laughs> Have mercy. So I'm, I think I'm going to cut this into two again. Now, back to business. Where was I? Back to my little hot mess. There we go. And we'll go ahead and pick this. But that's some of the stuff we've been working on, y'all. So there's tons more signs in there, too. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, y'all. We got to get all the... All the social media things going on. You know me and the technical names. I don't know all that stuff. All the venues. <laughs> That's what I'll call it. All the venues going. Well, that was good. It's like nice and... I li I'm liking those... Uh, um, cats, cattails or whatever you want to call them. They're looking pretty good. Have y'all been making a lot of those um, stacked pumpkins? 
I love those. I love those. And Walmart had them for like $15. $15. Reef, can you grab me a Band-Aid? Yeah, I probably think so. No, there's, oh, uh, maybe they are. No, I think there's some in the, in the get, in your bathroom downstairs. Oh, look, <laughs> and then it comes off. Okay, I gotta glue this. So we're gonna do our handy dandy. Well, you know, I couldn't, I couldn't expect this live to run smoothly because it's been so long. You know how that goes. So, <laughs> actually not too bad. I can't complain. Just going to stick that back on there. There we go. So, I wanted some of this light in the corner. This is looking pretty. I think the farther down I go, the more I'll have it go in. I'm really liking this monochromatic like uh, thing going on. Yes. And no bow. I didn't, I haven't gone shopping for ribbon or anything for the shop, but I do still have um, Christmas ribbon and fall ribbon. Well, I did get some fall ribbon in. Finally, my orders from, um, from Market are coming in. Finally, like Halloween. So I'll have a uh, ribbon for Halloween for next year. <laughs> um, but my Christmas stuff, I still haven't gotten it in yet, y'all. Thank you, Eve. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's been, it's been um, you know, I'm glad I had stuff left over from last year, really. I'm going to put another light one down here. <laughs> so Kathy's comment some for some reason is pin. <laughs> I don't know why. Oh my goodness. So are y'all doing like um Instagram lives and all that stuff too? Or are you just sticking with uh, Facebook? Or not lives at all? I gotta glue these in though. Because the leaves, I don't want to have too much to go back and glue in. But I'm liking this. It's turning out cute. I'm probably gonna have to put uh, some moss down on there. Because otherwise, this is gonna be one full puppy. I put a lot of foam on there. So, yeah, just note to self not so much foam on there next time. Not so much. Hi, Julie. How are you? Thanks so much for coming in. I appreciate everyone. Please be kind and spread the love. Sprinkle, sprinkle. I gotta, I gotta get my numbers up, y'all. They've been kind of stagnant. Well, I can't, you know, really complain because I haven't been live in a long time. Doing little ones here and there, but I thought I would do more while I was moving, but you know how that goes. How much fun is it to watch somebody move? And then you kind of, it's not in the best mood either. Moving just doesn't bring out the best in me. I don't know about y'all. But it was kind of a surprise sort of like thing that we bought the place. We weren't in the market to buy, but um, renting was just insane. It was just insanely expensive. And once you, you know, once you saw that a place was available, by the time you got down there to look at it, it was already rented. We were getting a little nervous for a while there, y'all. I can't lie. I like those little hops. Oh, what am I knocking out on my wall? Ooh, doggy. Don't get, don't get it. This is turning out pretty. I need something right down here. And I 
have a little cattail right there, so I'm just going to put, I think, a dark set of leaves down there. I don't know if I want, do I want berries there? Yeah, there, oh, there are. Huh. I'm trying to see if I want berries down there or not. <laughs> I was going to do a rail tonight, but then, you know, the last... At the 11th hour, I changed my mind. What? I know, not me. <laughs> what the what? Do I want to cut? I think I want to cut this shorter. Yeah. Huh? You made a picture? Oh, oh. Okay. Steve's working on some church projects. So he's gonna show me his little projects after we're done here. Almost done, y'all. But you can tell it's getting harder to push stuff in, so there must be a lot of glue up in that little block. See, that's where I, that's why I always put a, a thicker block than usual, but then it, you gotta cover, you know, so much. Fine line, right? A fine line. Y'all are mighty quiet tonight. Is everybody eating dinner? Probably. That's why I wanted, I really, really wanted to come earlier. But it just was not in the cards. Look at how far that one's sticking out. Too far, I think. I really need some height. I'm wondering. Wondering. It's kind of just looking like a little stump. I don't know. I don't. I know I need something right there. Big time. Oh, that's negative. The day is long. So, I'll do one, one of these light ones and then mix it with some of the dark ones. I just didn't want too much color in there, which, if you know me, hello, um, I'm kind of a color freak. I love, 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 lots of color. And just about everything I do. I added some purple lights to my mantle and a couple more things are going to get added between today and tomorrow. So I'll reshow my finished mantle, which is so cool because I haven't been able to do a mantle in a long time. I haven't had a um, fireplace in forever. I've been, and I love, love, love fireplaces. So I was so stoked to be able to do this. <laughs> and Halloween be over by the time I completely finish. You know how that goes. Well, it's just moving. It seems like I always end up moving this time of year too. The busiest time, you know, right when we start to get our fourth quarter going. But God's got a plan for everything. He just needed me to slow my roll for a hot minute. I'm going to have this Go at it angled down. Ooh, that one went in nice and easily. Oh, good. So that'll be closer. I don't see. I'm still not 100% convinced about this one. Wish it would bend down. Be careful what you wish for. <laughs> I don't know. I think I'm going to take that one out and try again. If it'll let me. Yeah, I'm going to set that to the side. Hold on. And just see if I can cut some, just some leaves. Some dark leaves. I don't even know if I like this, uh, this stuff, whatever that is. I don't even know what that is. I think that's the only part of the, the bush I really don't care for is that, whatever that's called. Yeah, I just didn't like how far that was sticking out. 
Now there's a big old gaping hole, but you know what I'm gonna do? Just go right here next to it and go down at an angle. And this will kind of bend. Okay, not too much. There we go. There we go. I want some more of this in there. I love, love, love this. Love it, love it, love it. So y'all, are you liking the design? What do you think I need to do? Come on, help, help us to stay out. I don't think I have any white berries. If I do, I just have no idea where they are, honestly. I think I'm gonna put some more hops in. Have this go up a little bit. There we go. See, I love those things. Aren't those cute? Hey, Joy. Joy says, hey, Steve. Oh, thank you so much for coming on. It's so good to see you. Just finished showing, showing some signs and some uh, pics that we got at Carolina Pottery and all. And we're making a little candlestick. Let's turn it into a big candlestick. I've got too much of this over here, I think. So I'm going to put some right here. I'm starting to get, I think I'm really close to being done now. I think, I think, I think I am. With only one injury so far. <sighs> Knock on wood. Oh, I wanted to do some of these. Oh, I got squirreled. Not me getting squirreled. Are you kidding me? So I think I'm going to cut this into a couple of pieces. See how I'm going to do this. Okay. This one, I just want a little bit of height in it, but not like raging height, so. Nothing worse than raging height, you know what I mean? <laughs> so, I'm not going to glue these. Remind me, don't. If you see me going for the glue, tell me to knock it off. I want these, I want to put this down here in the middle. Let's see what it does. Go in at an angle downwards. If I can see. Gotta get my yellow jobbies. I don't feel like it's hurting my finger again. Just so I can. I'm gonna pull this up through. There we go. Just so I can get something a little way going. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see if I like it. I don't know. Oh, I already picked this one. Good thing my head's attached for real. So I, I don't want it to go directly like across from it. So I'm going to go over here. Ooh, that one's a stiff one. Very stiff. Dang. There we go. There we go. Okay. That's not bad. I thought it I thought it was gonna look worse than it does, but it's not too bad. <laughs> I appreciate y'all spending your evening with me and Steve. It's just so weird not having them in here with me. It really is. But he's still working from home, so you know, you get used to uh, having some around you all the time. And it was just him and I moving together. We had one day with the movers to help move the big stuff because mm -mm, never would have made that. Three young, young men. So they were nice and strong. Helped us out. 
I don't know. I'm glad I didn't glue these in because I'm still not sure with those. What do y'all think? Give me your honest opinion. What do you think about these long ones? Yes or no? Let me know what you think, please. I need some help because I don't know. I don't know if I'm liking it. I think I like it better without. What do y'all think? I don't know how to get that off of there. That's so weird. Okay, I did it. See, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Sometimes I surprise myself. Maybe I should put some of this one instead. It's just too orange, just too orange. I love my new home. I love it, I love it. It, it fits like a good old pair of shoes. It really does. You know how sometimes it takes you a good while, a good hot minute to uh, get used to, you know, your new home. Now, other than just not having everything unpacked yet, I love it. Absolutely love it. We've been very blessed with this. Um, it's more than we ever expected we would have. Yeah. I think I'm going to stick some of this right here in the middle. I gotta remember to go back and glue these in. So what do y'all think about the long jobbies? I think maybe I'm just better keeping uh, keeping it nice and compact, huh? What do you think about these long jobbies, huh? Looks kinda, I don't know. I'm thinking I might add something to the top. Thank you, Joy. Thank you so much. That means a lot. It really does. It truly, truly does. I'm going to cut this separate. I really like this. I knew I would. I'm glad I kept it the neutral color. I kept going, well, I was thinking of adding dark blue to it. Because I thought the dark blue would look nice with the, you know, the natural wood. And then I was thinking of painting part of the can the um, candlestick holder, whatever you want to call it, the base. Thinking to paint it black and then going with black and and natural. But then I just finally said, you know what? Leave it alone, Willie. Leave it alone. So I did, and I'm really liking it. I'm liking it a lot. Gosh darn, I keep bending these things. Cause it's getting full in here. That's why. Steve always tells me I squinch a lot and I now that I see it on the camera, I really do squint a lot. I really just like the colors on this. I don't know. I just don't know. Leaving those alone. Hmm. I think I'm going to put these. Okay, y'all. <laughs> no when to stop, Willie. No when to stop. I want some berries right here, though. I know I do. There's a lot of brown in there. Maybe not. Isn't that where I took it out before? Probably. <laughs> Y'all, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, that looks cool. There we go. That looks cool. I like that. I like that quite a bit. So look, here's some, oh, I guess they're all green and green and brown, no white. I think I need some, okay, I need some cream right here. So be sure to check out my shop, y'all. I got lots of goodies in there. And um, 
I appreciate every one of you coming on and <laughs> watching me make my, uh, this one won't go in. Maybe it's not supposed to. Um, watching me make this, I really, I'm really liking it now. But I know I'm going to need to add some moss in some spots. It's looking a little... But see, this right here, this spot right here, it looks naked compared to the other side. Yeah. Oh. See right there what I mean? I just don't like being able to see the foam. Oh gosh, that's a big bear naked. How did I miss that? I don't know, Lily. But you did. Let's cut this one off. It looks like it'll expand pretty well. Yes, I'm definitely going to. I need, yeah. I had this sitting in my cabinet. Steve put some cabinets right there above me. And um, it was taking up valuable real estate. So I'm like, I've got to make it. Because I have a show coming up October 20th. Which I know, um, you know, will sell a lot of, for, for Thanksgiving. See, and I'm still selling locally, too. So I still got to make, you know, the... People didn't want to buy Halloween any sooner than, you know, I'd start putting out Halloween in September and they were going already, already. So yeah, my local people want, you know, t want the product timely. So I still got to make some fall, but I'm definitely going to, um, make some Christmas. Definitely like real soon. Cause I want to mix all in Christmas for the show. And then I have another show coming up the 20th of November. So um, I'm going to have Christmas and every day so that people can buy gifts and stuff, you know, for Christmas for their people. So it's kind of weird. You know, you have to make so early for your Etsy shop, but then you got to, when you're selling locally, you still got to, you know, make and sell for the time that it is and not ahead of time. So it, you gotta have all your supplies out. But I guess, you know, it could be worse. I didn't really get it with all the moving and everything. I really didn't get a chance to make a whole lot of fall. So I, I know I'm behind, but now I'm getting my shot. So I'll make some, I'll probably end up doing more fall, pro, you know, on my own than with on live. So, but look, y'all, what do you think about these long things? No one said anything. I need some help with these long jobbies. Should I leave them in or take them out? Because I'm really, really like him. I really like this. It's cute. Okay, Joy. Yeah. I, oh, I said, oh. mm. Yeah, I got I got myself some of those Santa boots. You know those fat flocked Santa boots. Um, you like the long long jobbies? Okay, yeah, it gives it a little something different, huh? Um, I got a bald spot right here. I got some of those Santa boots that are flocked when I went to um, D Wayne's the other day. Where did I? Yeah, I lost my spot. I hate when I do that. See, I like it going down though. Ooh, that looks so pretty. Um, some in, one in like teal and one like uh, a darker turquoisey color. I was looking for red and I was looking for hot pink, but they didn't have them. So um, I'm gonna see if I can get some online. I didn't see any when I went to market either, but I do have some candles. You know those candles, those big, fat, juicy candles that flicker on top that I had a bunch of last year? Yeah, I, I do too. Um, I like flock better than green too. 
I'm getting some of those in with Santa belts on them. So I'm just waiting for them to come. I gave all my, my wholesalers my new address. So I'm hoping to hear from them soon. But these are like, you know, the uh, flocked colored. I think I need, I need a dark right there to go down a little bit. Okay, look, this doesn't have a stain. Let me see what I can do. Let's play doctor here. I'm almost in a place, y'all. <laughs> I always say that, I know. And then I add just a little more, just a little more. I always find a hole. There we go. So I'm going to let that dry. Yeah, in fact, I'm going to try to go... Um, live again this week, and when I do, I have an idea in my head for uh, one of our signs. It's so cute. And then I made these um, um, snow cones with the uh, chunky yarn that are so cute that would go perfectly with that sign. So I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna make that up. It's got a penguin on it. Oh, it's so cute. Look at that. Ooh, that's pretty. Look, y'all. I think I'm just going to go up under there and add um, some moss. I need something coming down right there. I think this will do it. I got to watch my squinching, man. It's going to give me more wrinkles. See, I like it hanging down like that. I think that looks so cool. I'm sinking into my chair. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All of a sudden, I'm like, why is the table so high? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Well, I'm so glad y'all hadn't forgotten about me. <laughs> I was scared. I really was. I'm like, oh, God, they're not even going to remember who I am. Oh, look, that's right there. Oh, well, that looks okay. That looks okay. I'm just trying to fill up so I don't have to go in there and put any, uh, any moss because that's a pain in the tuchus. But I think I want a little bit of the cattail. I want to use this up because I've already cut the heck out of it. You know what I mean? So I want to make sure I use it up. Do y'all do that too? <laughs> I like to use it. I don't like to save leftover picks. It drives me insane. Because I, I just got so much stuff. I want to use it up. And I want to use the whole thing up. I don't want to put a little bit of it back. Because that just uh, drives me crazy. Uh oh. Big old drip. Big old drip. What would you call me? <laughs> There we go. Okay. Just trying to fill in some little holes. I love those, those cattail things. Love, 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 love them. I'm going to put this one in and I think I'm going to call it a day. Right up here. Then I can pull it through and put some leaves around it and blend it in a little bit. So it's not just one big old clump. Trying to get this up here. Oh my goodness. Do what I tell you. <laughs> Mm, there we go. Yeah, I think, I think I done it. What do you think? Do you like it? 
Do you like it? Does it need something? You can look from the top. What do you think? Turned out kind of cool, I think. Y'all love it? Give me some hearts if you like it. And it's so good to be back. So y'all be seeing some more of me. We'll be doing all sorts of, probably still some fall, but more Christmas, cause I need, ooh, I really need to get some Christmas going, so. Mostly everybody's like, I'm almost done with Christmas. Thanks, y'all. Thank you. I think it turned out pretty good. I can still see the green in there, so I'm going to have to go back and uh, put my little finger things on and put some of this moss up in there. So, because I don't want to put any more uh, leaves and stuff in there. But I like it with just the natural stuff. Should I put... I'm thinking I should put something up top here on the on the leaf up here. Of course, why would I? Well, that's cute. I'm gonna do it. The heck. Just dip it in the glue and stick it there. Hold it there for a second. Okay, y'all. Well, um, I think we're good for the night. <laughs> I really, really, really appreciate y'all coming back and saying hi. And I'm going to start um, getting my lives back going and uh, get some Christmas going. And we've got tons of new signs in the shop and some pics. And I think, you know, going to do what I can do. I got product coming, so... Yeah, we'll be making a whole bunch of uh, fun projects together. So thanks again, y'all. Have a blessed night, and it was so good to be back. I'll, I'll see y'all soon.